Well, hello everybody, Smith here, and welcome to another Animania Showcase! Yes, we've had a new update to the Animania mod, uh, some new creatures. So, in this uh, mod showcase, we're going to show you some new creatures. If you wanted to go and see the uh, previous version of the showcase, this is it here. You can go back to episode 2 of this series to see that. But today, we're just going to concentrate on the new... Uh, creatures that have been added to Animania and they are absolutely fantastic I must say finally we have goats we have goats in Minecraft proper goats so where do we start guys well we start with rabbits yes we got lots of rabbits here lots of different types so what I aim to do is we're going to go through them all uh, as I said if you want to see the older animals in this mod you need to go back to my uh, episode 2 but today we are just going to have a look at all the new animals because there's loads to cover and we're going to go through them all so let's start right so let's start with the chinchilla buck let's have a look at this little rabbit we're gonna, oh look at that oh, oh wow look at the detail again the dynamanium answer just let's kind of look at the dough not much difference there. And let's have a look at the cute little chinchilla kit. Oh, and oh, we're just what rabbits do. Look at that. Do the same sort of thing. We're not going to show all the food and stuff they eat. So I just want to show, show these off. Aren't they cute? They are gorgeous. Right, up next is the cottontail. Oh! <gasps> Oh, look at this. And these uh, rabbits replace the uh, normal Minecraft rabbits when you've got the mod installed. Wow, cute. And a little kit. <laughs> oh my, been waiting for these. Oh, there we go. So, up next we have the Dutch. Dutch book. Oh, yes. Now, a lot of our people uh, have families and they have pets like this. Aren't they cute? That's more like that, a little pet one. Oh, yes they are. And a kid. A couple of kids there. Oh, they really get to it straight away, don't they? Look at those, aren't they gorgeous? Right, so let's go for the next one. So here we have the Havana Buck. Oh, yes, lovely. I want some cages. I'm going to build some cages to put these in. And the dough. Oh, God, I love the whiskers. I love the whiskers and the little puppies, of course. There we go. They're so cute. Right, up next we have the Jack. The Jack book. Let's have a look at this. Oh, now that's nice, isn't it? I love the pink ears. Wow. Look at the little eyes. All the eyes move, guys. They are just so fantastic. Oh, dear. Look at this. Absolutely brilliant. Right, this one here. Lop. Lop. Ooh, F straight away. Lop. Oh, it's got the loppy ears. It's got the floppy ears. We love floppy ears. Oh, ah, so two different colours. I like that. I like that. And the babies. Oh, they're all different colours. They're all different colours. <gasps> oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, I never checked that out. Whether these are all the same colour. Yeah, these are all the same colour, but these are all different. I like these. These are well cute. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, love it. Right, on to our next ones then. Right, New Zealand Buck. Oh, yes. Oh, looks like the evil rabbit from Minecraft with the red eyes. Don't think so, though. <gasps> and then the little doe. And then the New Zealand kit. Oh, they're beautiful. Beautiful. Right, they're Rex. Oh, it looks like it sounds like a dinosaur. The Rex. Yes, that's a traditional rabbit. Oh, oh, wow, look at the size difference. That's good, nice to see that. I'm sure, yeah, it's def definitely bigger, definitely bigger. That's it. And put some kits. There we go. Right, guys, well, you do also get a spawn egg, which is a random rabbit, so we can just, we just get different ones. Oh, look at that, look at the tail. That's so cute. <laughs> so they're all the rabbits they make a wonderful addition so I like the fact that these uh, these are there but they do make wonderful oh look at that <laughs> and they spawn uh, basically the rabbits uh, spawn in the normal biomes that you find rabbits in uh, the, the rabbits uh, all rabbits breed and they cross breed ooh look well what will that that's the thing now. 
what sort of crossbreeding oh, you'll have to try and do some experiments with that and see what they produce but it means they probably just produce different uh, ah, yes that's interesting so what happens when you get a long-eared rabbit with a loppy eared rabbit it'll be interesting to see what turns out of that we haven't got time to look at that but that's really cute so what we're going to do now is we're going to have a look at the next batch of animals so guys now we're going to have a look at sheep i've always wanted more sheep in minecraft all different types so we've now got six breeds of sheep so we're going to run through the six breeds we're going to put two sets in each so we've got the frisian ram look at those horns oh wow oh and there's the female lovely jubbly and then we've got some little frisian lambs oh, they're all different colors oh wow oh wow 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 aren't they cute oh my god the detail is just so absolutely amazing so suffolk let's go to suffolk ram whoa 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 look at you holy woly that is a fantastic oh and there we go and let's have some baby ones these are all oh oh yes look 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 oh they're mating the crop but that that they they uh by the way the rams fight each other so you can see they they go test out oh we've got a new type here a brown one i love the fact that not only have they gone oh listen to that not only have they gone for the uh, breed, they've actually ensured that you get different colours as in real life. So it's really cool. Right, what's next? The Dorpa. A Dorpa? Never heard of a Dorpa. A Dorpa. Oh, what is a... Ooh. Have you got no... Do you have no horns? Dorpa Ram has no horns. Oh, that's interesting. Right, you... Oh, off they go. That's an interesting uh, sheep. I like the idea of it, that they're sort of two types, but they've been shorn, haven't they? And the baby one. Oh, yeah, they're all white. They're all white. There we go, white and black. That's superb. Right, let's have a look at the next three. So up first to the last three, we have the, well, we haven't got that, but we've got the Dorset Ram. Uh, Dorset, for those who don't live in England or Wales, it's southern England on the southern coast. That's a Dorset ram. I love that. That's well cute. Look at that. Fantastic. I think I'll grab two in. You can do some fighties. Right. Uh, Dorset U. Oh, 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 oh. Wow, 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 wow. Look at that. Look at that. That is so cute. The Hey, we got a brown one as well. I love the fact that the colour is is shaded as per real real animals so what are you do oh they're having a fight the rams are having a fight guys so let's just move out of the way let them fight and the babies oh yeah they're all the same so let's go over here a jacob ram jacob ram let's go and see what the jacob ram looks like oh whoa look at whoa look at those horns oh Wow, I like that. Use. Uh, oh, the ewes have horns as well. Oh my god, you can't tell the difference. How do you tell the difference? It must be. Is it bigger? Oh, no. Uh, oh, maybe. Yeah, maybe the horns. Maybe the horns are bigger and they. There's been. Let's put some babies in. Jacob Lamb. <gasps> They've got horns as well. Oh, fantastic. That is my favourite sheep. That's my favourite sheep. I like that. Right. Uh, let's have a look at the Merino. It's Merino, which is Italian, of course. Uh, Merino lamb's wool is fantastic. You get it in bedding uh, because it's so fantastic. You get it in, you can buy it in like quilts and and uh, pillows and stuff like that. I know. <laughs> oh, yes. Different types of rams. Oh, fantastic. I like you. No pun intended. Ha <laughs> ha, here are the ewes. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, oh, aren't they cute as well? Absolutely brilliant. Oh, oh, oh. All happening here, all happening here. And merino lambs, of course. Lambs will... Oh, they're so cute. But I'm surprised I'm not getting too much slowdown, to be honest. But there we go. And you... Uh, oh, did that grow? Uh, and then... I'm not going to do the uh, many other 
ones but you can see from that that they are fantastic there are so many i'm gonna to have to have in my series i'm gonna to have to have all sorts of different uh, pens and sort them out and stuff like that so they're absolutely brilliant so that brings us on to one of my favorite animals that i wanted in minecraft and we've got a special ending to this video so stay tuned to the end to see what we do with the goats <laughs> ranger goats so let's have a look what they're like right first up guys is the alpine alpine goat i call it alpine buck let's have a look does it look like your alpine goat oh these are the ones these are the ones that uh, run across the cliffs and jump across the cliffs they are fantastic look at that yeah they've seen on the richer david attenborough david attenborough's programs oh there's the female aren't they fantastic we like that and we put some kids in here as well i call them kids are they kids yes they are kids listen to that noise oh it's got the oh the goat noise is so gorgeous right angora oh yes you look cute right oh Oh, both all male and females all have horns, so it's all good. And the little kids are here as well. They are really cute, aren't they? I do like these. I do like these. Right, let's have a look. Oh, the fainting. Oh my god, they're going mad. Going mad. Oh, 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 oh. Mmm, you look familiar. Now watch this, guys. Watch this. Let's see if it works. <gasps> nope. I'm supposed to charge at you. Maybe, yeah, I've got the latest version here, guys, with the updates. Uh, if you charge at the fainting, maybe not, uh, maybe it's the doe. Uh, let's see if I can do. Nope, they should fall down and faint. <laughs> oh, there we go. Wow. And the fainting kid, of course. Maybe I haven't got the latest patch. Because just make sure, guys, that you get the latest uh, version. There's been two fixes to this mod in the last two days. Uh, but it's really fantastic right what have we got next so up next guys is the nigerian dwarf buck oh wow they are oh wow 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 god it just amazes me every time you bring the new ones out it's just the detail just goes on and on and on and on it's truly fantastic right let's put a couple of the little kids out Aren't they so cute? They are fantastic. Right, up next is the Pygmy Book. So Pygmy Book, I should imagine this is quite small. Not that small though. Not as small as those ones. That's well cute, isn't it? Oh yes. Oh yes. And then the Pygmy Does. Aren't they cute? Absolutely fantastic. And the Pygmy Kids. Huh. <laughs> right, let's go and have a look at the last two. So now we have the Kiko Book. Let's have a look at this. Oh, ho, ho, ho. do you know what? These goats are just truly a fantastic. <laughs> wow, wow, wow. These are all the same color, but they are superb magic. Right, and then we have the Kinder Book. Well, all I think of is Kinder Eggs. Oh, wow. Oh, yes. Yes, 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 we like that. Kinder dough. Oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. And some babies there. So, aren't they brilliant? You get the random spawn egg as well, which is really cool. Look at them all fighting and stuff. Absolutely brilliant. Uh, so, you've got... Oh, look, they're all having a good fight down there, I tell you. So, in terms of the, uh, in terms of the goats, uh, we've got the six goats... Uh, oh, the Angora do the Angora goats can be sheared. Were they? That's the pygmy one. So the Angora Nigerian, and this is the Angora fainting. Good God, what's this? Angora. So this can be sheared. Oh, very good. I like that. They're all in a good fight over there. Uh, and basically, they will spar. We've seen some sparring with each other because that's really cool. And uh, yeah, they're pretty good. Uh, oh, they eat all sorts of strange things. The goats will eat sticks and stuff like that. Right, which brings us on to the new update of uh, another, well, it's not an animal, it's a bird. 
there's been a massive update of the peacocks. Look how many peacocks there are now. So let's show you all the fantastic peacocks. So guys, there are five new peacocks to go with the original two, which makes it all very exciting. Uh, so let's start with the Indian blue peacock, of course. Let's put that one out there. Uh, oh, that's the pea chick, the little pea chick. Oh, I think I know what we're going to get. Yeah, says the uh, female and then the Indian blue. So this is the one that was... Oh, listen to that noise. This is the one that was in the mod already, which has been... I think it's been updated, not sure. But it looks totally cool, doesn't it? So let's go for the top chick. Aha. Uh -huh. The female. Oh, wow. Hey. And then the male. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Oh, wow. Look at those. Wow, 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 wow. Look at those. Absolutely fantastic. I love the fact that every single animal has a load of different types. That's wonderful. So, this was the white one next, which was already in the mod. Yeah, there we go. Yes, you can see that now you can see the difference in comparison uh, between the, uh, the, the white one and this one here, which is pretty cool. We can have a right... Uh, right, fantastic Avery with all these uh, going round. So, what's next? So, we know now these are all going to be new varieties, as I call them, of peacocks. So let's start over there. This is the charcoal. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Oh, wow, wow. Oh, yes. I like the difference in colours there. Oh, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Fantastic. Right, the opal, really? Oh, 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 I'm interested to see what the opal peacock looks like. Oh, yes. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Yeah, absolutely fantastic. So what's next? We've got the peach. Oh, peach, 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 let's see. So it's like a, the female's brown. Oh, yeah. Peach. That's peach, all right. Wowzer. Superb. Wow, look at those. Right, let's go and bring out the last one. So finally, then, we have the purple peacock. Well, the peach, first of all. Absolutely. So here's the pay hen. Oh, yes. This is, Hopefully, this is going to be... Oh, come on. What are we going to have? Oh, wow. So that's different to that one down there slightly. It better be different. Yeah, the purple peacock. So we've got two. Absolutely fantastic. So that's got all blue. And this one over here, that's got the green, green and blue. Much more greeny uh, fans at the end. So we also got the one that you can mix and match them up as ever so you get different ones and they come out as chicks hens aren't they gorgeous so there's the there's all the new animals so i'm just going to go through some of the fixes and stuff basically they're basically some of the stuff that if you go to the wiki which is, sorry if you go to the pages which are listed i've listed the wiki and i've listed the uh, forge pages in the description but basically there's loads of changes to the mating processes uh, males initiate the processes there's female milk providers cows goats and sheep will only provide milk if they've given birth uh, mates of any animal type can be broken up if moved more than 30 blocks apart uh, loads of new riding controls which have improved no end so it's all cool Sorry, now we had these before, just put these in here. Uh, and adult pigs, no, only adult pigs on leads can find truffles. So that's the, the truffles. Uh, and by the way, this is for 1.10.2, frog there. Uh, there are other enhancements if you download and install 1.11 and 1.12, which is really cool. Uh, there's loads of recalibrated health. Uh, and uh, there's the roosters uh, may fertilize eggs in close proximity. There's loads of bug fixes, which I'm not going to go through. Well, guys, welcome back. Uh, this is just a bit of fun here. Our T-Rex is so excited about all the animator animals, but one particular animal that the... Let's see if we can get this. Tie the goat up. 
Will the T-Rex? I know the T-Rex likes to eat goats. Uh, so it depends where she is. But if, because there's all the others around here. Uh, we are on our Jurassic Park world. Ah, uh, ah, uh, oh, ah, uh, oh, oh, you, uh, oh. Is she going to eat the goat? The goat's trying to escape. The goat, uh, uh, uh. Yes. And... Oh, she does. Oh, 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 oh. It's just like the movie. Oh, she's just eating that one, just like that. She ate that one, and oh, she's eating that one. There you go, she's just... Eaten when she becomes hungry, she starts eating. Oh, she's on an absolute rampage. There you go. Right back to the showcase. So, all I say to you guys is I hope you uh, enjoyed this little showcase. Uh, and uh, please come back and have a look at my series. We're using lots of Minecraft animals in my new series, which is really cool. But thank you very much indeed for watching, guys. And we'll see you next time. Thanks a lot and bye bye.